Anytime you turn on a light switch, you're completing an electric circuit. Electric circuits work a lot like turning on a water faucet. You can imagine the pipes leading back to a pumping station, with pressure making the water flow. With electricity, a generator provides the voltage for the electrical current to travel through the wires. Like water, electricity is pushed from the source, through the wires, to the user. But what is electricity? It can be defined as the flow of electrical current from a source to a ground. Unlike water, electricity will only travel in a completed circuit. When you flip a light switch off, you break the circuit. To turn the light back on, you flip the switch to complete the circuit again. So why does flipping a switch have this effect? Because it connects the three essential components of an electrical circuit, an electrical source, conductors, and an electrical user. Let's consider each of the three components, starting with an electrical source. This can be a battery, the power from an electrical outlet supplied by your local utilities, or a generator. Next, Wires or conductors connect the electrical source with the electrical user. Wires must be rated properly for the circuit. If too much electricity flows through a wire, or if the wire is too small to support the intended current, it may become overheated and fail. In a worst case scenario, this could start an electrical fire. Finally, an electrical user is anything that uses electricity to operate. That means an electric appliance, like a light bulb, power tool, or machine. In today's world, we are literally surrounded by electrical circuits. Every home, TV, car, and smartphone has an integrated electrical circuit. But electricity can't flow in an incomplete circuit. So each of the three components are critical. The electrical source, the conductor, and the user.